Hello YouTube, in this video I'm going to be showing you a bit of a mix and match tricks and a few hidden stuff that many people don't know about and I will be explaining a few things like the meaning of XP what does XP stand for or does it stand for anything so seeing as I've started talking about that one I may as well start with that one so what does XP, what does it come from? what does it stand for something? and it doesn't, it comes from a word I'll show you how to get hold of this word to prove my point so first you need to right click anywhere on a desktop where there's not a, a, a program and then we need to go to, down to properties so let's go ahead and right click properties and then this should come or something similar. Now we need to head over to the screensaver tab and then we need to click on the drop down box and click on 3D flying objects. Oh, sorry, it went wrong. And then it should be uh should be set to something like that. If you can see it, there's a little Windows 3D Windows thing flying about. Um, but now we need to head over to the settings thing. Click settings. And then this is very simple. All you need to do on this drop down box here where it says style and it should be Windows logo because I think that's the default. We click, click on the drop down box. This should come up and then go down and click textures flag click that and then click OK and then to get it straight away click preview and then that should come up it says experience and then the X and the P is highlighted and that's where the XP comes from from experience that's quite interesting I found now I found that quite interesting the meaning of XP is I don't really think about it but it's interesting to know that XP comes from the word experience and that trick was just to, uh, to prove that now the next trick will also be using the properties so we go ahead and right click then head down to properties click on that again this display property should come up you can also access this through the uh, control panel by going on control panel and going on appearance and themes I think and then clicking on display and it will come up as well I just find this way easier head over to the screensaver tab select 3 3D pipes I've already got it selected 3D pipes and then click settings now the same thing will not come up it will be slightly different this 3D pipe setting should come up and then where it says surface style instead of clicking solid you click textured so the textured box is highlighted then we go ahead and click OK and then we preview this here we go and then there we go looks a bit like uh, candy canes that you get for Christmas hangs on your Christmas tree uh, that's just a weird thing it's quite good actually I quite like the 3D uh, pipes I quite find them quite funny even though it's a screensaver so I probably won't be there to watch them but anyway that one's quite interesting so they were a couple of interesting tricks now as I said it's a mix and match so it's not the same but if you're not sure of your system info as in or your what speed your computer is and all that the gigabytes and all that you might not know a lot about it but to find out about this you need to go to start click run this is just one way there are many ways and then when you've clicked run uh, this 
this box should appear and I've got it as set as CMD because that was the last thing I entered and we do need to enter CMD standing for command prompt click enter or click OK this box should come up and then you can type in to find out your system info very simple a bit obvious type in system info and then it's loading and all that you see three dot dot dots here we go here we go there we go now this will come up with a lot of um, like files and stuff but don't worry it does it to everyone's computer and then that shows you your IP which you won't be able to see because I've hidden it but if we scroll up here we go it says all about my computer and all that and then all about that and that is it for today I will be uploading more tricks this was a mix and match so thank you and please comment and subscribe goodbye